Hey, Dan, I'm sending a package with instructions in it. It's something we're going to be bundling up in the template. I just had a few things to finish off or tweak off before it's added to the system. But uh, in a nutshell, you're going to go, you'll, you'll get a uh, instructions folder like this. You can just put it wherever you want, but, uh, you know, if you want to drag it into Dreamweaver, you can do that. And then there's a Dreamweaver page right here. You just double click on the page to, um, sorry, double click F12 of the page to preview in your browser and it will give you some more specific instructions uh, especially to I think the thing you're looking at is more like components by page is what you're probably interested in um, for example there's the home page right there so we have the bootstrap slider the index box carousel the header the sliding phones right um, those are different components that are in that page then for each of the other pages depending on the package you have uh, there's different carousels and whatnot, and here's all the instructions right there. So yeah, there's there is a new instruction package. It's it's the same. There's there's a lot of the same basic stuff, but I just wanted to make sure we had your question answered on the um, the graphic logo here. I'm trying to figure out what I uh, I'll open this back up here. <clears throat> so we have the website name right there, and then you have your graphic logo right here, and all it is is a font awesome icon. So just put your image in the graphic logo LBI. Okay, and the placeholder thing, yeah, that's those are definitely older instructions. I'm not sure where those are. It's, yeah, probably for previous generations. But anyways, just to answer your question directly, and then on the index page itself, right, there's you know some specific components in there that uh, you you would want to address. Let me just take a look here to make sure that we've got everything. So the bootstrap slider, the index box carousel, the instructions are in there, in there for that. The uh, video piece here. That's just regular text, regular text. The phones, that's information in there. That's just a picture. Um, that's just text. And this thing here, the Keras, the uh, isotope package, that is, uh, I think we have instructions. That's home page. Yeah, web packages, isotope portfolio, the two video demonstrations right here for sort of where to go and update that. So all your bits and pieces for the for the home page should be in there. Uh, testimonial slider that's down below here and that is uh, um, oh, you know what I'm missing from that so I'll tell you what the testimonial slider that's actually a if I have to open up the index page here flip it to design view Ugh. design view not the Okay, the header is basically, I've just tried to hide all the stuff in the header just so there's less clutter. And then I've used these things right here. The idea with these placeholders are you right click and you can open library item just like that. Okay, that opens it up. Then you follow the instructions on how to update. Okay, so that is sort of a new thing I'm trying out. We'll see what sort of feedback I get. Um, so if you see one of these placeholder -y things in the page, right, right, right here, right, just right click on it not sort of like anything that's got the sort of a screenshotty type thing or whatnot right uh, testimonials carousel just boom right click open the library item there's the text there's the link right if you want to flip it over to code view everything is wrapped in a slide now with the new ones you just do a copy paste and uh, you know that'll be the um, right but I have a uh, uh, for this guy here it's basically slide one two three and four Right, you just change the text in the page and away you go.